Okay, what's up guys? Uh, this is MCPT, and um, first of all, I'm going to say I'm not recording with Fraps. Um, I have to record with Bandicam right now uh, because of, I don't know, my Fraps is being uh, messed up. So just hang with me. This is the first kind of few tests. I'm back. My recording should be fixed for now. Um, but I'm going to be showing you how to uh, set up auto message for Bucket 1.5.2. Uh, now they changed a lot of stuff in this for instance you need a certain permission to see the message and you can have it set up to all different uh, users and everything but if you want a really lightweight one um, I'll leave a link to this it's scheduled announcer and this is really lightweight this is pretty much auto message but uh, a few updates back so basically what you're going to want to do is go to the auto message bucket I'll link in the description just download that sorry I still have a little bit of a uh, uh, snot nose and then go to wherever your server directory is located so plugins and it, for this you need um, a permissions plugin so you can use whatever I just have a simple uh, group manager So once you see that in there, then just start your server, let that all load, and it will generate the files. Then go to plugins, then click auto message, go to config. Now here's what you gotta do. I'll leave a link also to this page, which is basically, oops, sorry about that, it'll say the variables you can use and then all the different color codes and uh, the special key things so like italics bold underline uh, but basically let's see so uh, enable true meaning if you want the plugin to be enabled um, sometimes I disable mine when I gotta add stuff or when something's messing up and I try to find if it's that plugin or not um, if you want to log to or the minimum players that it will be displayed to, like uh, the minimum players that will be online to be displayed to, that's what that is. So just leave it at zero and that's the default and it will display it to everybody. Um, log to console, that means that when you're in your console it will log every chat to your console. I usually deny that unless I'm testing. Um, auto update, uh, false. <laughs> uh, that can be a little buggy. A uh, little buggy, sorry. Um, I still have a little can't talk straight yeah but that can be a little buggy so I just always leave that to false okay so now we're gonna get into the actual messages so let's see default so this is basically saying the default rank so let's name uh, I think I named my default rank noob so let's name that noob let's name this guy donor and let's audit okay so interval let's make this every Two seconds just so we can see them all same thing for the next one um, if you want to enable this one for this certain rank true if you want to do it random which means it will display these messages in a random order uh, then you can do that and this is the prefix so let's just say uh, I don't know message noob I don't know and then all this one will be message done Donor. Donor. Um, so basically, let's see. So let's go up here and let's create this message. Let's delete this. And let's just say, thank you for joining our server. So I'll basically display that line saying, thank you for joining our server. Then if I do another one, and name it uh, uh don't need I'll just put don't need to show you something so if you need to use an uh, I forget that what it's called I think it's apostrophe <laughs> um basically you can't use those in OIML just because the way it uses it you have to use you have to set up another thing so I have to use that that double apostrophe I'm not really sure if that's what it's called either um but then you can just don't leave the server so you can do that for say um so this then will message donors okay so 
I believe this is the permission. I'll have to double check, but I think that's the permission because it's pretty simple, straightforward. <sighs> Permissions. Da, 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 da. Yeah, that's the permission. So let's just copy that and let's open up my uh, like group manager I use. You can use PEX, whatever um, groups. Okay, so then my, I have my default, which is called noob. So let's just name this uh, noob. And then let's name this one right here called donor. And I'm not doing a tutorial. Uh, tutorial on group manager that's just basically I'm not gonna do that right now I've done other tutorials on that and I'll probably do one in the future well if we go back here you say uh, thank thank you for donate donate I think that's how you spell it donating to whatever your server name is we great yeah greatly appreciate it Okay, let's do another one, say, I don't know, you are awesome for donating, um, you can really do whatever you want, but, okay, so if we save this, and you make sure in your, in your, uh, permissions plugin, that you have this permission, so auto message dot receive dot and then whatever you named this so I would just name it your group name or you can name it say like donators and give it to all the donators or uh, all the regular players or all the admins like for instance if you want to make an admin one you can make it say like remember don't abuse commands or don't give items out I don't know stuff like that uh, but then what you're gonna want to do is just start up your server let me go back I should really open my minecraft Okay, so that all loaded up properly, no errors, so then if I go to multiplayer, and then localhost, login, now I should be, yep, here we go, I'm a noob, and as you see, it's saying, thank you for joining our server, uh, don't leave our, don't leave the server, and it'll just keep repeating that, because I have it that way. Um, now if I add myself to donor, so if I add myself to donor, I'll say thank you for donating to yada yada. Yad. We will appreciate. It. We greatly appreciate it. And it also, and it keeps saying you are awesome for donating. Now if I had another computer, I would simply show you that it would. It's not showing that for the all the default players, um, but I don't, so <laughs> I can't do that. Uh, but as you see, very simple uh, plugin, um, pretty lightweight unless you don't have permissions system, which most servers do anyway. Uh, I will be redoing my uh, server tutorial, so complete server tutorial guide. I'm going to be redoing that. Uh, I know I kind of stopped after <laughs> the first episode, but I'm going to be redoing that. So uh, I guess thank you for watching. And I uh, greatly, greatly appreciate. Oh, what the fuck am I saying? I, don't, I can't talk today. Uh, but I greatly appreciate everybody who stuck with me. Um, so thank you, and I'll have more tutorials out soon. See ya.